All right, so I know we have been a little bit uh, inactive for a while. There's been a lot of crazy stuff going on around here, uh, namely kids. They take a lot of time. Uh, but our fourth and final is in preschool and doing really well with all that stuff. So we're starting to get back, kind of back in the swing of things. And one of those things that's been on my mind, been trying to do, is make this video on how to start a small, how to start a sawmill business. Uh, I've done a ton of videos in the past about how I set up my business and just little tips and things here and there. And uh, when the COVID pandemic hit and everything kind of shut down and things changed, uh, at that time I'd already sold my mill. Another topic. Um, but basically I had a lot of time on my hands. I was at home doing the kids and Sarah was also at home, but she was kind of building a business. So we kind of swapped roles there. Uh, well, I had all this sawmill stuff on my mind and I started just typing stuff out. And next thing I knew, I kind of had an ebook going on just how to start a sawmill business and all the little things and the doodads. And um, basically I'd been making sawmill videos for however many years and I had been getting questions and kind of, I'd built the businesses myself and I figured a lot of this stuff out the hard way. I did a lot of research and just answering all the questions, getting all the questions, hearing them all, uh, all the emails, phone calls, uh, just talking in person to various people. Uh, you know, there's just a lot to it. And, you know, it, it was just kind of spelling it out. Um, you know, a couple videos just doesn't do it justice. Uh, I mean, I don't know how many videos it would take to, <laughs> to do it. Um, so basically it just, it just ended up being a book and uh, it's about a hundred page book. There's some pictures in it here and there. Uh, but it's just kind of all the nitty gritty of all the things that uh, you should think about if you are thinking about running a sawmill business. Uh, and it goes from buying a mill, what kind of mill you would want, what would work for you, kind of how to set up your business, uh, how to take money, how to charge money, what kind of products to sell or services to sell, how to deal with customers, um, you know, just all those things. I mean, I'll put, I'll put a list of of table of contents and a link to it in the description. So if you're interested in that, uh, go check it out. Um, it's pretty cheap, it's about 10 bucks. And it, if you're not satisfied, by all means, let me know and you're gonna get your money back because that's the point. I mean, 10 bucks is nothing. It's just basically kind of help um, recoup some of the website fees and stuff like that. And, and just a little bit of the time. But I mean, all this stuff is out there, it's just, not in one place. So what I did was I just kind of put it all in one place and an ebook is the best way to do that. I had been talking to a few people about making a hardbound book, like something physical to do. And, and that took me a lot of time, honestly, trying to figure out that because I wanted to get it published and, and do the whole thing. Uh, that's just quite a rabbit hole. And, and you know, I don't want to get into that. Uh, so an ebook it is, <laughs> and it's just a PDF. You can print it, uh, you know, or whatever. Uh, there's nothing, nothing crazy about it. But like I said, if it means you're not satisfied with it, by all means, you get your money back. You know, uh, totally guaranteed on on all of that. Um, it's just so much information and so many questions that I've received and answered over the years, and it's just it's just the best format to put it out there um so there's that and there's also a bunch of other stuff coming up we got hint one and hint two right there uh so stay tuned if you're interested in that uh and also we've got these playlists uh, of all my sawmill business stuff and then also just running the sawmill uh if if that's of interest to you if you just want to kind of see either one so there you go and Thanks for watching and see you next time.